So then in 1985, crack hits New York. Do you remember the difference in the landscape when that happened? Um, not really. Not really at all. But I'm thinking about you saying um, Richard did start having kids because I remember um, the girl being pregnant with his first son, with his son. Okay. So that, but the crack, I never saw it come in. I know I saw dope, I saw coke, crack. By the time crack came, it was like videos being made. And they were showing you in videos, like sometimes the crack users, the, how they smoking the crack. And then my, my, it wasn't called crack then. To me, I believe I remember when it was called freebasin. Yep. Like I heard of freebasin first, and it was grown people that I knew had done that. But I really didn't connect nothing. I don't know. If, I don't even know if it's the same. But I remember freebasin, and then crack. Okay. Well, that same year, nineteen eighty-five, Rich Porter gets into a shootout, and he gets one year in prison. Mm -hmm. Before that situation. Was he getting into shootouts and beefs no. and no. Thing, things were smooth? I think that was related to his, um, one of his dear friends, um, L.A. mother's house being robbed or something. And the house was robbed. L.A. ended up getting killed. Like, I don't know how close in time frame the incidents happened up, apart, but I think that has something to do with that. Like, it wasn't nothing else before that, where he was in a shootout, this was the first time that that ever happened. Okay, and he gets one year in prison for that. 18 months, I think, but 18 he, did, months. he did one year. Okay, when you found out that your your big brother has to go to jail for a year, as and by this time he's how old, like 20 or so? Probably 19. 19. So he now has to go in into an adult prison. How did you feel? I was sad. I was sad, period, because it's my brother. Yeah. Like, I didn't like it, but he, like, he talked to us before he left. Tried to say things that would ease us. It was what it was. He went to jail. How'd your mother take it? She was furious. Furious? Yeah, she was furious. Mm -hmm. She cussed him out? Yeah, she had a mouth. <laughs> Okay. She used it. Okay, so Rich goes in, and AZ starts to build up during this time. He started becoming a cocaine wholesaler, and he starts making real money. Um, according to reports, like $40,000 a week, or sometimes even more. Now, you having a child with him, was he like buying you things and taking care of you guys and everything else like that? Yes. Like, what were some of the things that he was buying you? Jewelry, cars, furs, bags, all of that kind of stuff. So you were just getting spoiled. But I was already. Like, my father gave us a lot. He did a lot for us. My brother did even more. And now it's my daughter's father. Like, that was there. Spoiled. Just normal for you. Yeah. Okay, but aren't you guys still living in the same building? No. We still, we still have the apartment. We're there. Mm -hmm. Like, that's a, a three-generation apartment. Okay. It went from my grandfather to my mother to me. But through all of that, it was still other stuff going on in between. We're still there. We still have it. We're still there. Okay, but you don't get a different spot somewhere out in yeah, the suburbs? Yeah, there's been plenty of stuff that we went through, but you know how I think what one thing that I learned is you go through different stages, you do different things, but you never let go of home. So importantly, like you can always refer back to, and that's what I did. 